Peplink is out with the Antenna Max Duo, a new rooftop antenna enclosure where you can house a couple of different routers inside the enclosure to basically eliminate cable loss from your cellular signals. Is this a good option for you? Details after the break. Hi, I'm Andy with the Mobile Internet Resource Center, and today we're going to talk about a new product from Peplink called the Antenna Max Duo. Now, the Antenna Max uh, series, this is the second one, is a, is a set of rooftop domes that have cellular Wi-Fi and GPS antennas, and they're also designed to hold one of several specific Peplink routers inside the housing that can be mounted uh, externally. Uh, that provides um, an integrated solution for cellular connectivity. Now, the advantage of this design is that because the router and the modems inside the router are co-located with the antennas, the antenna uh, cable lengths are very short, and basically it eliminates cable loss for your cellular antennas. Now, the new uh, Antenna Max Duo it uh, provides eight antenna elements, so it can support dual 4x4 MIMO or two 5G modems. The uh, Antenna Max that was released earlier supports a single modem or router. This one supports dual uh, modem and router, and it's designed to work with specific Peplink routers. Uh, the Antenna Max Duo can work with the flagship Max BR2 Pro 5G. This is a Peplink's router that includes two 5G cellular uh, modems, or you can use two BR1 Pro 5Gs uh, together, uh, two of them, or you can use a BR1 Pro 5G and a BR1 Mini 5G. Uh, these are the three configurations that the Antenna Max Duo supports. Now, how this works is that the routers are powered with power over Ethernet, and that Ethernet cable also provides the data connection if you need that somewhere else, say on the inside of your boat or RV, an access point or another router to provide LAN capabilities. Um, if you do have one of the uh, two mode, two router designs, the the dual uh, BR1 Pro 5Gs or the BR1 Pro and the BR1 Mini, you will need an optional uh, Ethernet splitter to uh, enable uh, both of those to get powered. This content is made possible by our premium members over at the Mobile Internet Resource Center. We strive to create unbiased content for our audience. We are not sponsored. We're not driven by affiliate sales and we don't sell stuff. We are here to provide unbiased content and for that we are funded by our members and our members get a lot of additional perks for their support. So please, if mobile internet is an important part of your lifestyle, consider supporting us. And this does obviously come with some limitations that you need to be aware of. So if you have this mounted remotely or in a difficult to get spot, it's going to be challenging for you to change the SIM cards that you may have installed in there uh, or to use additional Ethernet cables or for the BR2 Pro to take advantage of the USB port for USB tethering. So there are some downsides to this design that uh, you need to consider. And, uh, and if it's worth it to have those short cable lengths versus the inconvenience of having your routers mounted in enclosure on the roof. This also is not an inexpensive an, uh, antenna design. It does cost $7.99, which is more than, than twice the price of the uh, a single modem antenna max at $349. But for those who need that uh, specific capability of having your routers together with the antennas for uh, eliminating that long cable loss in those uh, specific installation situations where that is a definite concern, this is a great option to have. So if you want more on the Peplink gear or the Antenna Max, we do have a companion article with this and we also have our gear center, which goes into all the specifications and details on these. 
and uh, other Peplink products, as well as everything mobile internet related. So please check out our website if you get the chance. But for now, that does it for today. We appreciate you watching. Stay connected, and we'll see you next time. These videos are brought to you by our premium members, our mobile internet aficionados. They make it possible for us to track this news and create these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel, or better yet, consider becoming a member yourself.